Hello, my name is Red, and welcome back to my Trashy Toy Reviews. And why am I, why, why am my cr voice cracks like so much right now? Anywho, this is the, today we're just going to review this, the SD, SDX Standard um, Banshee Norn, Unicorn Zero Two Banshee Norn. I forgot what the, from Bandai, of course. It's because EX Standard is from Bandai and there's no boot like of Anywho, let's get into the review. <laughs> okay, I hate myself. Anywho, so while building this, it's actually kind of fun in, in a way that it's fun, if that makes any sense. Because it's a dark. It's a dark mobile suit, and I really like to clean up uh, dark plastics because it really makes me to challenge. It really makes a challenge for me to have a very cool, very uh, clean. Not really clean right now because there's some crap on it. So, anywho, why am I saying anyone like that? Uh, uh, what the frick am I doing? What the anywho. This is what has my channel has been, you know. It okay. So any freaking hell. Let's just check about the details of this. The head. It's it's okay. It has a lot of stickers, which is like what the heck. I mean, I do not despise stickers though i do not like them also it's 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 in between it's a little bit janky like here you see it's just what the heck and of course as an next as an sd figure it has a lot of stickers just like i said earlier from the head i do not want to point him out point him out a lot I don't want to point them out. I don't like to point them out. Oh my god, why can't I talk? Why can't I talk? Why can't I talk? I, I mean, I don't have much else to say about this. And let's just try and do the articulation. Let's just remove all of this bull crappiness that is the weapons. And yeah. So articulation wise, the head can move down that far and can look up that far. Hopefully that's enough to have some flying fo poses. I mean, it is enough for flying poses, but you know what I mean. It is on a ball joint. It's a double ball joint, um, double ball joint crap. I do not know what the name is this, uh, because, just because. Um, <laughs> God damn it. Oh yeah, this this thing's just falls off like every time, and I hate them so much. I mean, I can so I can cement these like in place, but I want some playability in my toys. I I, I need to pose them. I the shoulders on a hinge poly cap, on a ball jointed hinge ball poly cap like. There it goes again. There, there it goes again. On a hinge, if you can see it. Like, where's, where's the, oh my lord. Oh lord. Right. It has in a ball joint hinge that can move out that far. It is the shoulders are in a ball joint, so it can go 360. It can move. As I said, can move out that far I can move back that far which is pretty good god the arms are on the ball joint like it's on the ball joint y yippee it's on a ball joint and a hinge and the, 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 the fist it's on the ball joint and the waist it's on the hinge the ball joint like it hinges like 
that and moves left and right just because I don't know what ba- how Bandai does that and the front skirt it's on a hinge that can move out that far the legs on a ball joint can move forwards forwards I hate this mantle so much main I rather not mantle can move out that far and it can move back that far it has a ball joint to the at the at the feet as per usual if you have <clears throat> if you have an SDEX standard you know uh, the articulation of it so yeah the po- the toes can the feet can move down that much can go can pivot that much can be bit out of the way then it doesn't have any s- right swiveling on the feet though so i mean it's enough to make to have a dynamic pose it's enough to have a dynamic pose just like this standing pose I mean, it's enough to have that much power to the pose. I mean, it's fine, but it really needs its weapons. In which, it has two. We have the beam magnum with beam with the rocket launchers. I think I forgot. Uh, it's flat why is it flat of course it's an it's an it's an it's an it's, a, it's an easy, easy ex standard kit so the weapons have to be flat and it can be put in the, the hand just like though just like so not though my lord and we have the armed armor whatever this is defense extension so this is the armor armed armor de defense extension eh? nice it has a lot of stickers you can pop it right off just like this it has one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven stickers and i love it you can be plug it into the hole right here just like so and there we have the unicorn banshee Narn. and let's just give it into a nice pose just like that and I mean I wish I have a um, a spinning turntable and but I don't have any money right now so this will do stop falling off balance your sh- oh good lord gracious I mean it's not the most stable model kit that I have though it's really fun to have a simple pose like that and yeah this review is just like is just gone overboard and the the views nobody views my videos and yeah i forgot the frankenstein weapon so i just look it up for a moment and let me let me just see how am i going to make it so be right back now here we have the spite magnum it's a thing it's a it's a jabby jabby pew pew thing and it kind it, it, it and it makes banshee a little bit it, it just makes it stupid now on to the next frankenstein weapon if that even makes sense now here we have the crossbow magnum if that's its name because it's kind of cool name to be honest it's a pew pew crossbow crap and I think you can just even put the horns, I think. So let me just get it. Now here, now here we have the Spite Crossbow Magnum. 
and we actually um, need to uh, remove this crap but I think you can just put it right there and call it a day and I forgot to mention you can actually put the magnum in the back oh my lord just like in the normal unicorn SDX standard hopefully this works I think it's plugged in like that I think it's plugged in like that or like this I actually forgot or maybe like that or maybe like that I think it's like that and I think you can still put the the shield I mean I mean you can but it doesn't really I think it makes sense because of the baby. anywho so the, that's for the review and maybe I will go back with some more higher quality videos right now it's just fast crippling crap that I need to put in like 10 minutes wait it's already 10 minutes it's already 11 minutes okay so that's for the review I mean it's it's 10 out of 10 would actually recommend this it's it's a pretty nice SD figure for a for for a, I think for 600 yen yeah you can just totally buy this if you have determination and painting skills because this actually needs some paint a lot of paint like the backs of the arms just doesn't even have color like the backs of the shoulders I mean doesn't even have color it's just too plain and I might actually just repaint this model into a a perfectibility no one knows if I can make one so yeah I mean it's done thank you guys for watching and maybe you got you, you, you can leave a like if I you can even make a like oh god this is a, this is a long ass video